Okay, so what is the biggest challenge when it comes to LinkedIn outreach? It's the limits because you can only send 20 connection requests a day per account. So if you want to scale this, you're going to stay stuck. So what if I told you you can run outreach from 10, 50 or even 100 LinkedIn accounts all automated. So this is exactly what we built inside of NetN that's going to send connection requests and messages from multiple LinkedIn accounts to your prospects all automated. So if you want to level up your outreach approaches or use this for your business, make sure to join our school community where I'm going to upload this flow right there. And if you're new here, I'm Magdalena. I'm the co-founder of Replic. I'm here to help you automate your entire outreach process with strategies and approaches that actually work. If you're interested in that, make sure to follow for more and let's get started. Okay, so before we get started, let's talk about why you would want to scale LinkedIn outreach because cold email is flooded right now. People are getting hit with so many salesy emails every single day and most emails never even get open. But with LinkedIn, way less noise and way more attention. The only real blocker here is the scaling and this is what we solve in today's video. Okay, so the hack to scale LinkedIn outreach. LinkedIn limits you to around 20 connection requests a day per profile. If you're exceeding this, you risk to ban your profile, so you have to be careful. But with Unipile, each profile costs around $5 a month and you can connect as many profiles as you want to NetN. So this is Unipile and as you can see, if we have up to 10 accounts we pay $55 a month and then you can scale this up to above 5,000 accounts which is insane because if we look at the numbers one profile means 20 requests a day means 100 a week we have 10 profiles it means 200 a day thousand a week and we have 100 profiles it means 2000 a day and 10000 a week and if you are a small company and don't have enough linkedin profiles you can actually buy them or rent them through something called mirror profiles for instance you can rent linkedin accounts ready for automation and you have link unity that's verified by real people and ready for automation so now anyone can actually scale LinkedIn outreach. This is fully automated and fully scalable. And this is how the system works inside of NetN that we built here. The first step is that we pull leads from our sales navigator AI agent. My previous video is about this. So if you haven't yet, make sure to go back and check this out. And then after we're going to connect multiple LinkedIn accounts through Unipile, we use AI ChatGPT to generate a personalized first message. So all of the messages is going to be different adapted to each of our leads. None of them is going to be the same. We're going to send connection requests at scale from each account in a safe way as we are rotating the messages through all of the accounts that we are using. I'm going to explain this further when we go into the flow. And once the prospect accepted our connection request, AI sends the first message in a natural and human tone. All of this runs in the background. You don't even need to touch LinkedIn. No copy pasting, no tabs open, just results. And this is why this works because your prospects actually see your messages on LinkedIn. So unlike emails that goes to spam or promotion inboxes, each new LinkedIn message comes on top of your inbox. It doesn't feel like spam because messages are contextual and relevant because we are not copy pasting. It's going to be different messages to each of our prospects and you bypass cold email competition and you scale without the limit. So now when you understand the power of this flow, why you need to do LinkedIn outreach at scale, Scale. Let's dive into the flow. Okay, so in today's video, I have two flows for you. So I have this one and also this one, and we're going to work with this Google Sheet right here today. So if you watched my previous video, I showed you our Sales Navigator AI agent, which basically allows us to just insert a search for the target that we want to reach out to. So find head of sales in Sweden, mid-sized companies in software solutions. And this AI agent is going to then find all of these leads inside of Sales Navigator for us. And in this second flow from the previous video, we retrieve the Sales Navigator profiles and then we add the leads information to the sheet. So basically this is the information that we see right here in this sheet today. So this is the first step. So once we have the leads, that's actually when we can jump into today's flow. And today's flow, we have this one and we start off with a scheduled trigger. So every day we're going to retrieve the last 20 leads inside of this sheet right here. 
multiplied with the number of LinkedIn accounts that you have. So if you have one account, we're going to retrieve the 20 last ones. If you have two accounts, we're going to retrieve the 40 last ones, etc. So we're going to process all of the leads one by one. And we build it like this to avoid the LinkedIn limitations to keep your profile safe. And then we move on to the next node. This is the one here is where you set up all of your LinkedIn accounts. So here you go through Unipile and use their ID for each of your LinkedIn profiles and then you add them here inside of anything and here you add as many LinkedIn profiles as you want so here I just have an example so we are using two accounts today but you can add 100 or even thousands of accounts right here and basically what this one is doing is really important because we're not just sending 20 connection requests from the first LinkedIn profile directly we're alternating so when we have sent one through the first account we're going to then send the second one through the second account and then we're going to send the third one through the third one etc so we're going to alternate through all of the LinkedIn profiles that you have until we reach the end and then we're going to loop it back to the first one and the second one and the third one and the fourth one etc to have a natural flow and a natural delay through all of your LinkedIn profiles this is a way to scale it and still make it safe for your, your accounts so once we have all of the leads right here and we set up all of our accounts then for each lead we're going to process all of this so first step is that we're going to retrieve the leads information from the profile and then scrap the information so we use something called Nubella here that's going to scrap the leads information and also the company information so this is Nubella it's a proxy curl API and you can also instead of this use Appify where you have the LinkedIn profile scraper and also LinkedIn company profile scraper so this is the information that you can see that we have right here so here is all of the extra information that Nubella gives us so we have the industry company LinkedIn company website it also gives us company description, the last post of the company, their size, the lead scoring that we have uh, further on in the flow here, and also the messages that we actually sent inside of LinkedIn. And here you can see that we sent the connection request. So we have yes here and then yes here. So this is connection request from account one and two it's going to alternate through all of your accounts like this. So next step is when we have the company information, we're going to then qualify the lead based on their score. So we insert certain criteria here, like their industry, company size, their title and location, for instance. Only the leads that meets our criteria, we're going to then send LinkedIn connection request to that person. And then we're going to update the sheet once the connection request is sent. If the lead is not meeting our criteria, we're just going to update the sheet with that information. So here you can see an error, and the error means that this lead didn't match our criteria and that's why we didn't send them a connection request. So that's the first flow and the second flow is basically to every day again check if the leads inside of the sheets that we sent a connection request to if they actually accepted our request if they accepted our request, we go into then craft a personalized message using ChatGPT, and then we go into then update the sheet so that we can follow their journey. So here we can see that we sent a few messages, and here you can see that the messages we sent is really contextual. I really liked your recent post about creative automation. That means that we use the last post on their company profile, and then we are taking that information and saying something like, it's such a smart way to tackle the chaos of juggling multiple formats and markets at a time when campaigns need to be both faster and smarter. It's clear how valuable that kind of efficiency becomes. I'm curious, how do you see creative automation evolving to support even more personalized experiences without adding complexity? So super humanized, super relevant, and we're starting conversations that actually would make the prospect curious. And then obviously we are changing the messages after the leads. So here we are mentioning something else that is relevant to this specific prospect instead. So no more copy pasting templates, just changing their first name, actually contextualizing the whole message towards each of our prospects. And this is how we make LinkedIn outreach actually working, not only scaling, but also scaling it in ways that actually would give you the results that you're looking for. So now I'm going to run the flow live to show you how it looks like. 
now we're going to force the flow and we're going to retrieve the last 20 leads or if you have two accounts like we have we're going to retrieve the 40 last leads we're going to alternate the connection request through our profiles we're going to retrieve the information about each prospect and see if they are matching our criteria and if they do we're going to send them the linkedin request and also updating the sheet so here we're going to see how this looks like and the flow is going to basically automatically fill out all of our leads information right here. And here you can see we just sent a connection request through our second account and then it's going to alternate through our all different accounts like this. So next one should be sent from our first account again and here you can see that it was from our first account and there is an error here and it means that this lead didn't match our criteria so we didn't send them a connection request and here we can see that it matched our criteria so we sent a connection request so here in the second flow whenever someone accepted our LinkedIn connection request we go into then use ChatGPT to personalize a message for them and then send them the message on LinkedIn and then update the sheet so here I'm just going to First, this flow and it's going to go back check and if someone did accept their connection request we're going to send them messages and then update the sheet right here and if we go to LinkedIn I forced everything to my own account here you can see that we are sending them messages like this on autopilot that is super contextual and it's reading the information we have about the leads the recent posts we mentioned something about the recent post and then also a super relevant call to action that is not meant to be salesy but actually starting new conversations with your leads and this is how we make call outreach and LinkedIn prospecting actually working. This is how we start real human-like conversations and actually building relationships with the leads. So I hope you see the power of this and how you can scale your LinkedIn automation on autopilot without any limits. If you want this for your own business, make sure to join our school community where I am uploading flows like this each week in this classroom for you to use in your own business. So we started this community for those of you who are struggling with sales and automation to scale your business. Foremost for salespeople, entrepreneurs or business owners. So if this is you, make sure to join now because prices increase each 10 members. I really look forward to talk to you again in the next video. Until then, have a good week. Bye.